In this video, I will show you how to analyze some type of dimensions, some specific type of dimensions using NX Open Programming. For example, let's take this typical drawing. In this drawing, there are only a couple of views and few dimensions uh, on each of these views. Let's say I would like to analyze the whole dimensions and the value of these whole dimensions. Meaning I would like to know the diameter of these holes. This is a very simple drawing with only one sheet and couple of uh, drawing views. But if you would like to do the same thing where your drawing is a little bit extensive, maybe a couple of uh, drawing sheets or more than that and uh, several views there, it might be a tedious uh, job to do. So let's see how you can do this with a programming. I can show you this with help of a journal. Journal is nothing but uh, an NX Open program. And definitely, if you wanted to know how it works, you must have knowledge of two things. One is the programming language itself and a uh, NX Open APIs. That is the second thing. Okay. So here I have used some APIs from UF. UF stands for user function or which is again popularly called as user function. So what I have done in this uh, program, basically I have captured all the dimensions using this API. The API itself is called cycle objects in part. So I'm, I'm cycling through all the objects and I'm picking the dimension type of objects from this drawing file or a drawing sheet. And then I have written some filter to find out only whole dimensions and report those whole dimensions. Let's see how it works. Once I play this journal, it's going to give me some output like this. You can say it has given me two values only from all the dimensions which are there in my drawing sheet. Those are only the dimensions of whole dimensions or the diameters of these holes. So this is how we can quickly review this uh, dimension, uh, whole dimensions from a sheet. So this is going to be a very, very productive thing as compared to a manual thing. This is just a simple example with simple drawing sheet and simple use case. But programming is something that you can extend to literally anything. For example, you would like to review the dimensions which has some tolerances given on it. You would like to only review that and along with the damage, uh, tolerance values and to tolerance type as well. So you can report those uh, few set of dimensions and you can analyze that in a very, very crisp and simple uh, format or simple output like this. For example, you would like to review the, all the nodes in your drawing sheet. So that is also you can do. So definitely you can extend it to any type of annotation. Basically it can be dimension, it can be node, it can be weight symbol, it can be anything else which falls under annotation. And you can write a code uh, to only filter those with some properties or values that you can report in an information window like this so that you can analyze that on a quickly basis. So if you think something sort of this you are doing and the programming like this can help you out, please comment in the comment section. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. 
I'm on mission to educate design engineers so that they can make their workplace productive and they can free up themselves from doing the repetitive or uh, mundane tasks that eats up most of their time in their work. So bye-bye for now. See you in the next one.